hello everyone so today i have my crafters companion um a christmas advent calendar we've been opening it i've been uploading those openings on the um, youtube short so if you haven't seen those do go over to my shorts and have a look catch up on the doors that you might have missed so what i thought i'd do today is i'm going to open um a couple of more doors a few more doors with you this way we can have a quick chat about it um and just you know talk about what we think about this calendar so far so we are up to day number 17 i'm going to open that now it is here so let's get going so as i've been opening these i have it's been getting more and more difficult to get these doors open so we're going to get into this one and ooh, it is a embossing folder. So door number 17 is an embossing folder. We've got this little cross hatch. Again, it's got the Gemini branding. Absolutely gorgeous little folder. I've got to find something to keep all these really small um, bits and pieces in because I don't have anything maybe a folder or something like that because i don't really have anything this kind of dinky which is really good in one way because it's not something i have in my craft room but then i need to find how i'm going to store them so if you have any ideas put them in the comments down below how i could store these little bits and pieces so they don't get lost really so that was door number 17 i'm now looking for door number 18 um it's not on this side it is on this side door number 18 where are you 17 where is 18 you guys can probably ah i found it <laughs> there's door number 18 guys oh this one's much easier to get into <gasps> what is it what is it oh it's quite a big stamp it's a big stamp and it is, oh, it's a basket with some picnic foods, a bit of wine, cheese and some bread in there. This one doesn't seem to have a die with it, but, you know, it's super simple to fussy cut. So that's door number 18. I think we'll go to door number 20. What do you think? I think I'll go to 20. So that was um, door number 18. Let's door number 19 is on the other side. So let's give it a quick switcheroo here's door number 19 get it open oh we have some dies and they are oh there we go pop it out so we've got some acorns and some leaves super cute i don't have any really small leaf dies and i definitely don't have acorns i love this size as you know for like can make atcs or i've been making some really small cards and things so this size perfect for those um for those projects so that was door number 19 and then the last one we're going to open today is door number 20 and again it's on the other side it's on the father christmas side i call this the father christmas side and we have the christmas tree side so door number 20 get in there oh we've got oh we've got two a double whammy so we've got so we've got a lovely heart oh i see i see so we have the heart and then what we do have is i'm believing these are sentiments so you got love you just for you me and you be mine and i think that they fit in the middle there so you can um, stamp a little sentiment in the middle. Isn't that cute and sweet? So we got two stamps in day number 20. And then I'll stop there and we will open. We've got, how many doors we've got? We've got four more doors to go. So we'll open the four more doors in a, another video. So thank you guys. Don't forget to leave all your comments down below and um don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already subscribed and don't forget to hit the like button if you've enjoyed opening this crafted companion 
Christmas Advent with me. I've really enjoyed sharing it with you guys and seeing your comments um, as I've been pulling out what, what we've been getting each day. Don't forget to catch up with, um, with the other doors on the shorts and I'll see you in another video. Bye.